in the largest class in 11 AAA. What a group of dominant players. And it just so happens that this year's group are all seniors. We've got record setters, all-time greats, and even some future D1 players on this list. Let's start with O'Gorman's best receiver of all time. The future Jackrabbit helped the Knights to an outstanding season. 62 catches, 922 yards, and 16 touchdowns. Canyon Bauer has rewritten the receiving record book at O'Gorman High School. His head coach, Jason Poppinga, says Canyon is a leader on and off the field. He's improved every year. Canyon's talent is obvious, but his commitment to the team and selflessness helped drive the Knights the past three seasons. All right, let's take a look at the most acclaimed player of the group, Tupac Capella of Sioux Falls, Washington. He had his best season of his career, and that's saying something. 2,056 yards and 24 touchdowns. And by the way, Tupac assaulted the 11-man South Dakota High School record book in 2018. He's now the all-time leader in rushing yards, rushing touchdowns, and total touchdowns. In that senior year, he rushed for over 2,000 yards the first time in his decorated career. Nobody has moved like Tupac. It was a treat to watch him the last four seasons. Another receiver on this list, Carter Altoff of Brandon Valley. 57 catches, 1,264 yards, and 20 receiving touchdowns. His skill set and athletic ability made him a difficult matchup for every team. And if you didn't double him, you had trouble keeping him under control. His raw athleticism made him an instant matchup problem for everyone. And in a school that's had some great receivers, Carter is the all-time leader in the school with 20 touchdowns in a season. All right, how about Jaden Johansson of Sioux Falls, Washington? After an early season appendicitis bout, he managed to throw for 1,924 yards and 22 touchdowns, and he added 454 yards on the ground. He's thrown for over 6,000 yards passing in his career and 68 touchdowns. And by the way, his GPA is 3.9. He's got offers from Army and from North Dakota State. And his head coach, Chad Sadim, said, without him, I don't think we make it to the Dome over the last three years, especially the last two years. All right, quite a different group of athletes to choose from. But in the end, the choice goes to Tupac Capella. He elevated his game, uh, in, elevated the entire game of high school football more than anyone else. He had one of his healthiest years of his career, and he got that 2,000 yards while rewriting the record books in the state. Congrats to Tupac.